Hand to God, and NBC's Trial and Error, Stephen Boyer. And there you are. What's going on? This is pretty cool. It's Broadway. It's Democrats. I love Broadway. I love Democrats. You know what nobody loves? Civics. <laughs> they, uh, please don't fall asleep. They, um, they brought me out here to talk to you about something, uh, super boring. Um, they said to wear a suit so you'd have some credibility. Uh, I, I also, I brought everyone's favorite cat toy, the laser pointer. <laughs> That's fun. Um, and I have a visual aid so you all know that I know what I'm talking about. So you're in good hands. <clears throat> May I have the diaphragm, please? <laughs> okay. Now. Who's smart now? Who knows the structure of state-level government? Just raise your hands on up. Raise your hands. Okay. Cool. 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 You're all lying. <laughs> Nobody knows how state government functions. People in Albany don't know how state government functions, okay? So I'm here to fill you in. Up here, you got the federal level, down here you got the state level, okay? Now they mirror each other. So up here, you got the Senate, you got your Schumers, you got your Gillibrands, then over here you got the House of Representatives, you got your Nadlers, you got your Alexandria Ocasio-Cortezes. <laughs> Just keep tweeting, just keep tweeting, just keep tweeting or I'll drown. Yeah, don't worry though, he's gonna be fine. He, uh, he took a test and he can identify cartoons of zoo animals. So. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna be fine. <laughs> <It's good. laughs> okay, so you know all about this nightmare. Down here, down here. Look here, this is what we want you to look at. This is the boring shit, okay? <laughs> State level, now this all mirrors the stuff at the federal level, okay? You've got Cuomo right now as the governor. Now just think of him as like the president of the state, essentially. Over here you have the New York State Assembly. It's like the House of Representatives, they just call it the State Assembly. Now the New York State Assembly is overwhelmingly blue. It is super blue, and they are trying to pass progressive legislation left, right, and center. I mostly just left. <laughs> but then they bring it over to the state senate, and that's when it hits the roadblock. And with these IDC guys and gals and everyone else. The, the IDC is, you know, Republicans in Democratic clothing. And it's, uh, we've, we're, our vote is being, is not being honored here. This is like, what they've done is they have we have democratic control of the state senate, but now that the IDC is in, is in there, they have given the leadership of the senate to a Republican. This is the one guy that can say what comes up for a vote or not. And now he's a Republican, even though we voted across the state overwhelmingly to have a democratic state senate. This is like if Chuck Schumer had the gavel and he handed it over to Mitch McConnell, so Mitch McConnell could be like, uh, we are not going to bring up this uh, progressive legislation <laughs> to vote because it would uh, help too many people. <laughs> you didn't know you were getting a Mitch McConnell impression tonight. <laughs> Neither did I. <laughs> so that's happening. That's what's happening here in New York. They're just, it's like just handing the gavel over to the Republicans. Now, we're all sitting here hitting the snooze button. So when it comes to civics, we're getting a big fat F. But we can turn it around and we can get an A if we get out there and we vote on September 13th. September 13th. That's the turning point in New York State. Okay, 
one last thing, one last thing, it's a math problem, and I know this is probably the wrong audience for this, because the entertainment industry people here. <laughs> this is why we, we, we don't do math. But, uh, so a Democrat generally wins the general election in New York, yeah? So if New Yorkers don't vote in the primary, if they don't get out and vote for which Democrat is going to go on to compete in that general election, and more often than not win that general election, if you're not voting, in the primary, are you even really voting? No. No. She said no. <laughs> I'll take it. No, you're not. So everybody, get out there. New York, get out there on September 13th. Vote your ass off.